We've got the Yankees and Orioles, and the Orioles always seem to be playing the Yankees tight as the Yankees trying to snap out of a little three-game funk losing streak here. Starting things off, Anthony Rizzo, he's going to help with that. That's his 11th homer on the year. Yankees, they have got some big mashers this year. Already have Rizzo, Stanton, and Judge with multiple or double-digit home runs on the year. Jose Trevino, that's going to be his second on the year. A Yankees pickup right before the season started, and I'll be getting back to him later in the game but he's just so good defensively that's why they got him but anything he can add with the bat is a plus glaber torres he has really been having a good stretch recently and that's good he could be returning to that 2019 form where he was just an all-star type player but then since then the last two seasons have kind of been tough for glaber but he always owns the orioles he had another two homer game tonight austin hayes he might be the yankees kryptonite on the orioles as he always seems to be getting big hits late in game to make it a close game so Austin Hayes he's going to be hitting the homer cutting the lead in half and then the one run game who but Rugnet Odor Yankees fan favorite from last year he hits a three run shot that's going to put the O's back up by two in the seventh inning so this was a crusher for the Yankees off Michael King too who has been unbelievable all year out of the pen for the Yanks but we're in the bottom of the 11th Jose Trevino he has a three hit night including a homer and this one walk-off hit right here so the Yankees snap their three-game win streak thanks to a big walk-off by Jose Trevino fun win and also their 30th on the year